electricity was invented in 1879. Finally, a world of labored inventions are at nigh. The inventor himself helped many. Oh, was he so open-hearted. But little did he know that the present generation has taken electricity for granted. Why have people taken it for granted? Is it not that they know the value beyond it? Or have they not thought it as a bliss, that most times its value is a miss? Abundance is very much abused, that some people are plainly amused. But it's nature that abuse has its limit, and that is when it shows its demerit. The air in the room is rather cool and breezy, and yet one thinks the atmosphere in the room is rather greasy. Isn't that an act of one's selfishness in ignoring the saving of electricity? And yet when it comes to others, it then becomes an act of hypocrisy. Why do we abuse the usage of electricity? Do we really want to go back to the way our lives used to be? To be stuck in and to weave around in complete darkness? How can we to get to talk about galaxies? One person to find the odds. What if, what if that one person stands his ground as the world slowly rotates around? What if, what if that person could start from you and I? I. Give it a try. What if one person is willing to fix all of their blunders? Come one, come all. Let us rise. And let us awake from this with no slander. Conserving electricity is not and never was a hassle. So why? Why do we act like conserving electricity is like confronting with a missile? Why are we so afraid to act wisely? You may think how can one person make a difference? Well, my friend, one person can influence. That influence, as time passes by, will make a difference. That difference, in the end, can be achieved with perseverance. Perseverance is not hard to achieve as we wear masks to avoid deceit. As we walk the path of this gravity, together we become one in unity. I challenge you, I challenge us, is it not hypocritical for us to apprise someone to do their part if we ourselves do not abide? Hear ye, hear ye, this is to unity in diversity, look no further, look within thee, the power to change and conserve electricity for the better is within you and you will be nothing more greater.